Welcome to Thornton, a district on the outskirts of Bradford. Here is a secret, a lost house that with your help, we want to save. Behind the door of this unassuming terrace house on Market Street in Thornton, began the story of the three most famous sisters that the world of literature has ever seen. They were Charlotte, Emily and Anne Bronte. But you can see, you don't need me to tell you, it's empty, it's for sale, it's forlorn and it's derelict. So we need your help to put together the final piece of the jigsaw of the Bronte story. At the time that the Brontes were living in Thornton, Mrs Bronte was alive and they enjoyed a social life which they don't seem to have had um, anywhere else. They made friends in Thornton um, and Patrick Bronte reported that his happiest days had been spent there. The whole family were together. Howarth was kind of tinged with tragedy. Thornton, they were a happy family all together. Now for many, the connection between the Brontes and Thornton has largely been forgotten. But you know, the people of this community never forgot their vicar and his three famous daughters. So much so that less than 50 years after Patrick's death, they raised hundreds of pounds to build this magnificent Bronte memorial organ. Less than 30 years after that, they built a huge brass plaque proclaiming the 100th anniversary of Charlotte's birth. And only 10 years ago, a new permanent exhibition with Bronte artifacts opened in this church. But there's one piece of the jigsaw that we need to complete their Thornton story. It's such an important place for the Bronte story, for, for feminist story, for literature, for the arts in general. And do you think the community will support us in our endeavours? I, I think so, yeah. You've got to I, do. Well, I'm, a, I'm part of the community and I support you. Steve, let me ask you, is this now on the map, Thornton, as it should be? No, no, it's not. And I think we have an opportunity now to put it firmly on the map. This place is, Bronte enthusiasts know about this place, but the whole of the Bronte people do not know that this is the birthplace of the Brontes and my passion for this place has to be to tie it as part of the Bronte way. The next step was the Bronte house. And if you forget that, this is a one day destination for anybody, any Bronte fan. So here's how you can help us achieve our dream and secure this building for the future of Bradford, for the future of young people in Yorkshire, and indeed for Bronte enthusiasts the world over. You can visit us and see all our plans on www.brontebirthplace.com. You can buy a share, a little brick that will preserve its future. You can give us a donation, you can hold events. But what we have to do is make sure that never again does this building look sad, forlorn and unloved. Because behind these doors began the greatest story that literature has ever known. Thank you.